In the previous session, we completed the Gantt chart or the harmonogram for our exercise in the early start position. Now we will create the Gantt, but for the late start position. The data are still the same. We have the same exercise, but now we will concentrate on the red numbers, on the late start information. Here is the basic information and we have the harmonogram or the Gantt that we have to fill. For the first activity now, like I said before, it is critical and it starts from period 3 and 4. Then we have activity B from period 1 till 4, activity C from 7 till 9, activity D from 8 till 9, activity E from 5 till 9, activity F from 8 till 9, the next activity is activity G, which starts on period 10 and finishes on period 12. Task H starts on 10 till 12. And finally, activity J starts on period 13 and finishes on period 15. We completed the two situations of the Gantt chart or the harmonogram. Now we will continue with the next session where I will explain you how to use some project management software. See you in the next session.